Damn, nigga, what the fuck are you holding your breath for? No, because now you two get to gang up on me. <laughs> no, I wasn't even doing The fuck you weren't. You was... Everybody that I knew from the go. I know hoes that was right, but they knew they was broke. Like it, you sounded like a game show host. <laughs> This is the Minority Plus One Podcast. Chill. What's going on, everybody? And welcome to the show. It's the king of the Heffries. It's, it's Oreo. Oreo. We are back once again, podcasting to you. And as always, we got the ladies. Yeah. Really, you. just nothing. Y'all yeah. just gonna just sit there. You took the, you took the yeah. Oh, that sorry, that's a you that's thing. My thing. That's a you it's too late now. thing. All right, well, whatever. So, Dollins, tell them who are you? It's Sam Crystal, Aisha, and I'm your host, Steve, and this is the Minority <laughs> Plus Ooh. One Podcast. Chill. Yeah. So, as Ooh. you guys can tell, we got a guest host this week. We talked about it last week. Mm -hmm. We were gonna try while Brittany's gone to have. A special guest for every week that mm -hmm. she is out and being tardy and living her best life and better be getting me my fucking souvenir. She'll, be super She'll never when see she this. Back. She doesn't matter. She's you're, never going to see this. Never, you just I don't give, give up fuck. the souvenir thing. She you still didn't me even ashtray, get the ashtray. And you saw. <laughs> and that was from last year, I feel like. <laughs> I, it's from two years ago. <laughs> and remember, I got you guys souvenirs from Disney. No, you did. Definitely. <laughs> I would get you. I don't, I'm a thoughtful friend, Steve. I always ask you if you're fucking hungry. That is you need anything, bitch? That's a good friend. Okay, I always take care of my friends over here. I will get you something. I'm <laughs> so Don't project that on me. I ain't Britney. So Dang. filling in for Britney this week, we have the original OG, one of the original three. She has been on the podcast before. She was on the episode A for Addiction that was that's available everywhere. No, she wasn't. Yes, yeah, she was. That, no, hers was... Weed nurse. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that's right. I'm sorry. A for addiction was Britney's first podcast before she became. Are you sure? Are you serious? That was her I'm, first one. Yes. Oh, see, look. That, fair so enough. Britney's first podcast. You guys can go listen to it. It's streaming. We weren't filming yet. That was Britney's first podcast before oh, we made her permanent. Yeah, Each right. was weed nurse when she was. I think that's she, she was correct. Just, I, I don't even think she started nursing school just yet, and she was getting into nursing school. Yeah, and we were talking about that. Though. It's crazy. So we got one of my best friends ever. My homegirl, Ish. Hello, everybody. Thank you for having me. This is great. You guys are awesome. <laughs> Thank you for being on. She's not really British, but... That's <laughs> not at all. That's her nervousness. Yeah. Don't worry. It'll... Hello. If you hear accents, just ignore it. <laughs> I wish I could do it. <laughs> Don't British get offended. <laughs> Please. Hello. Hello, governor. Hello, governor. Oh. <laughs> Would you like some puppies? Mm-mm. Oh? Maybe some tea. See you, some, some crumpets. Tea, scrumpets. Some fucking scrumpets. <laughs> fucking A. Are we allowed to curse? I don't know. Of yeah, course. Oh, of okay. course. Oh, God. Yeah. Of course. Fuck yeah. Uh, fuck a yeah. Anywho, how was y'all's week? America. <gasps> fuck yeah. Well, I want to get this out the way. Let me tell you something, white people. Go ahead. Oh, Jesus. Let me tell you something. I don't know who, even though it's genius, but like who decided to make a fake gold mining mine and charge like a hundred dollars? But it's not fake though. Fucking per person. Per, per, oh, no, no, per, I'm, oh, I'm, I'm lying. Say. But still, <laughs> it was it was a hundred dollars for like four of us. And listen, let me so just twenty five bucks. But a piece. To, just to beat on rocks, my nigga, like it was just hammering rocks. But That's what if it. you found something worth the value? You wouldn't be bitching. But you, if I, I wish you would. Okay, I don't think you're understanding the mine. How big. And rocky it was. No, and it was 90, Sam. I'm just saying it was like nine degrees. It's hella rocks. <gasps> I didn't even know what to. You don't know what to look for, my nigga. All you see is a sea of ocean of rocks. <laughs> rocks. Every fucking turn is a rock. They all look the same. They all look like the twins. Like you don't know what to to hit on like that shit was why did we do that that was the worst experience one of the worst welcome to white men activities I've welcome ever done to in men in the dating circuit you just don't know what to hit on Let oh me tell my you god I but think, come on come i told you on. i'm the comic that relief was that was fucking great but anyway that was great that don't, was great yeah don't do that 
It's my. It's uh, already been it? done. Wait, did people have those little it. things that you could find? Like the no, beep, no, beep. those metal detectors. Oh, the metal detector thing. No, but I'm telling you, all, there was tons of white families there with their little white babies with gloves and goggles, and they were all just beating on these rocks trying to find stuff. Like I think we literally paid twenty five dollars to dig through dirt. Why not? Did people stuff. pay more than that just to do fucking CrossFit, and all it is is just hanging on some fucking CrossFit? monkey bars. That makes sense. <laughs> That's all it is. That you can do the same shit sense. at the park. <laughs> Like legit so, the same so as that shit. Come on, guys, we're gonna out. lift a fucking tire. It's five fifty a month, but you're gonna feel amazing. Definitely it's CrossFit. Five fifty a month. Yeah, that's Fuck that shit. anybody. Could I'm sorry, yo, if you do CrossFit, you're a cross fucking dick. Wait, so Damn. you wouldn't pay? I could respect that. You wouldn't pay? I mean, yeah, I'm about to say. I wish I sorry, could. Sorry, I'm speaking that just out of jealousy. I can't afford it. I was just about to say because I wish I could be one of the people that get a pull up. Can you? I can. Ooh, thank you. You don't need to know. Oh, okay. My bad. That is none of your business. Asking. You can do a pull-up. I was just asking. Yes. Sure? Why do you think I What's can't do a pull-up? You look a little weak. I know. What's I'm purposely empathetic. looking this way. <laughs> oh, purposely? <laughs> yes. I'm purposely trying to lose as so much weight as possible. So you're purposely trying to look Because weak. I want to go back to my old fit. You need I to just lift weights. I don't know what you're trying what to do. You should be trying to do. Hook up. Ish. You're mad skinny. You remember mad, me. You've shape. known me longer than anybody. You remember back in the day. And I remember this vividly. Yeah. Because when I would make my little muscles, it was just straight up rocks. It's just straight you up. Just and straight how up did you tone. obtain Wait, those muscles? Oh, I was, I was, first off, carrying a fucking laundry bag from Osborne, <laughs> downtown Osborne, <laughs> all the way up to where my grandmother lives. Okay. Up those oh fucking hills God, daily. How, how else did you obtain those muscles? <laughs> you want to fucking know. Did you, work the field? did you work out? Yeah. Okay. Wait, I'm not so, saying they're saying so that I'm cheek right now, yeah, I'm but I'm trying say, to get back. So each Steve, Give me time. Steve, so I don't really believe this. So he was in shape at one point, Steve. I was in spending well, you time. Know, when you're younger and you're working out, that's you know, not, going no, to no, the gym no. all the She's time. not going to shortchange me like that. Oh, okay. I was fantastic. I was, I was deceptive strong okay i mean and that's what i want that's what i'm going for now i don't i want you to think i'm a bitch that i can't that i'm not strong well, i, don't I think want you to think bitch. that I'll no i want the people i want the people to oh, think that i'm think. weak frail uh -huh. think whatever you the look, fuck you I want about say, me i know you're not weak because think you, whatever you want i know you're, you're right weak. i am 100 percent weak and frail weak. <laughs> you just look weak i'm 100 percent weak and frail what your goal is because you're already slim Right. So you don't need to lose any more weight. I wish I had, you know, your slimness. Same. But all you have to do is lift weights. I mean, what, <laughs> I just don't know what you're trying to do. She said do some curls. I don't know what you're trying to do. Let me work on it. Okay. So learn. you want to lose more weight and then start bulking up? No, I'm not bulking up. I think that's what you guys are mistaken. I'm not trying to bulk up. So I want to get back down to like 160. Ugh. Okay. How, how much you weigh now? I actually have no idea. I don't. I don't. You probably I think weigh you less, less than, than 160. Yeah, I'm about to say that. I definitely weigh more than 150. I guarantee I weigh more than 150 right now. Oh, that's I know. Below do you guys have a? Do you, hold on. We I refuse do the break. to get a scale. Do we have? No. Do you have a scale here? I refuse to get one. Okay, because so once you get 160, then I what? Refuse. Then you know that's when you tone it up. That's okay. when you get everything all nice and chill. So you trying to have okay. packs and wear like I'm white beaters all summer? No, no. I, I still. I'm sorry. White beaters. Just, I just sorry. don't think you I lose have more any more weight. You look great. You, you look fine. Yeah, you. I think you could actually gain some weight. You know what? Why are y'all body problem. shaming me? me no, I'm not body That's shaming. Not body shaming? You crazy? I think you look fine. Just we just don't gave lose you any more weight. You look weak and frail. <laughs> I mean, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, you said you want to look like that. You said that was your goal. <laughs> To look weak and frail. So That's if exactly I were to be you, like, you look heavy and tired. I know. I'd be I like, I'd be like, you're actually <laughs> right. I'll you look like, 100% yeah, yeah. right. I'm like, I you're absolutely right. Y'all see the temper. double standards here. I uh, can go to sleep right skinny now. Skinny right now. Skinny people. Uh, and I'm not even skinny right now. See, they're so little. Oh, man. Look I at this. Look right there. I have double that. Look at that. <laughs> right. Double trouble. It's not Steve. sexy it's right tough, there. It's tough, bro. It's not sexy right there. But you could wear. How are all you ladies, though? Good. Good. Great. That's awesome. What about you? Oh, no, I'm okay. Skinny girl. I'm okay. You know, found a way to save some more money. Not eating? Well, Out. no, I have I have been doing... So, <laughs> for, like, the past, like, two days, I've been going, like, the first, like, 18 hours not eating. Fasting? Oh, no, no, not even fasting. fasting I'm, just, I, I'm just doing it for, like, I don't know why. Like, okay. I just don't, I just don't feel See, the I need to eat. I don't eat 
like that's the this is the most annoying shit. And I said it on like the last podcast. I don't eat like shit. I was trying so to tell you. I don't you. understand why I'm a fatty. Your metabolism. metabolism. I know I'm getting older. It's slowing down. I'm getting mm-hmm. wider, and not in the places I want to get. I'm still shaped like a capital P. And like, what are you eating? Like, not, not nothing. Like I said, I ate a salad for lunch today. Mm-hmm. I eat salads like almost every day at work. Yeah. It's is so it much iceberg balance. lettuce it's or romaine? Like, oh no, please. <laughs> I'm not ghetto. This is spinach <laughs> and kale, me. maybe. Jesus. She's got yeah. the mixture. God, see, I don't like what? icebergs. It's, it's all waters. I can't, I can't wait to reach her it's tax okay. bracket so I can have that kind Nigga, of Nigga, that shit arrogance. is like $3, okay? Calm down. Farmer's <laughs> market. Oh, um, I, we're not even there yet, Steve. We are still at Walmart <laughs> getting our produce <laughs> with all that pestos on it. Oh, um, no. <laughs> Asbestos and pesticides. Asbestos. Yeah. What the oh, fuck no. is asbestos? Is that like the ghetto version of the Mentos? No, the shit for the, the asbestos. Come on. The shit for the walls. But, uh, I was being funny, but um, no, we still get Walmart produce, nigga. We like. I these? do love. You know, I do love Whole Foods, but it's just too much. Whole Foods. It's Jesus. Too much money. Too expensive. That's what, Try no, all these, bro. I love Whole Foods, but it's too much money. Yeah, all these is. But nice. you used to love Whole Foods. You no, just, I didn't. Are you sure? I you must be thinking about somebody Ooh. else terrible oh Isn't i mean oh yeah i used to buy my chicken there Thank for sure you. yeah yes. yes you're right because you put me on to that that's the only thing i bought there the All chicken because right. i wasn't going trying to buy anything else it's too expensive it's too for expensive. no reason well then like now it's almost the same price as shit in in hannaford's and stores now it's the same mm-hmm. price mm-hmm. same shit trader joe's it's, is cheaper too for some reason I don't yeah know that. I hate grocery shopping now. I love grocery 100%. shopping. One hundred percent. I, I hate fucking it. Hate Why do you guys hate grocery shopping? I hate it now because of inflation. <laughs> money. Money. Fair Spending enough. money. You no, get three right. things. Right. When it's, it's like just you, hours. I was about to say, when it was just me, bro, I used to before inflation, before I swear I'd spend a hundred dollars and be good for the for the month. <laughs> yep. Just me. Yep. Now yes. now question four hundred dollars. Can you guys spot like an, like another person? Who's single? Like you could tell by what they're picking up, oh, like and like it's in their, in their cart. What's in their like cart? Like if they're single or if they have kids or whatever. No, I can only tell when they got kids because it's two carts. I don't pay attention <laughs> that much. Because I noticed that shit. Because how I shop, mm-hmm. and that shit is it screams Bear. single man. Yeah, it oh, so screams it's like free, it like yeah. frozen dinners. It's and... I, not so many. It's it's it's, it's a, a lot of pasta. Things. It's yeah. a couple things. Yeah. It's usually. Uh, yeah, a lot, there is a lot of frozen, frozen stuff. Frozen stuff, yeah. <laughs> no, you, stuff. you know, it's funny that you say that because that's so true. Because, like, when I'm daydreaming about being elsewhere in the grocery store, I do look at people's carts. And yeah. it's true. Someone who is single. Or you see, you ever look at a person, their cart is full of junk food? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And I'd be so like, how are you not dead? <laughs> it's Damn. like cookies and chips and candy and soda and that's all oh, when it's full to the brim I'm like to damn the brim. Yeah, I'm not I know, damn, damn, when it's full to the brim I'm like that EBC just hit like, damn <laughs> can I have some please, please. but hold that thought cause we, we gotta, gotta take, take a break, break. back <laughs> so i actually thought a little bit more sam about uh the question you asked me and that steven what do you want in a wife hmm oh uh, when we were talking about it last week yeah about pop the balloon or die by the way more oh. shit came out about about that <laughs> that aaron yeah we talked about it last week about aaron the plumber and more shit came out he's gonna kill somebody son <laughs> like that thing is scary like yeah, he's nuttier than squirrel. Yeah, shit. Like, I told he's got that. so many charges, domestic charges. He, he track like he put like a smartphone yeah. in his girlfriend's car to track her. I said that. Is that the pop the balloon thing? Yes. yes. Oh, the big Lord. ninja turtle. I was gonna say thing. the ninja turtle. Him, thing? he's scary, bro. He looks scary. Why is he on the streets? On the loose? He's on the loose. Well, uh, he never got none of that money, by the way. For yeah, the I know. Fund me. I know that. Oh, okay. I I told you that I had known all that. And you said, Stephen, you don't fucking know. I, no, you I don't. Didn't. You claim I you didn't know. Say none so of then that. explain. Explain. I didn't. I didn't say any of that. Dang. Like, who were you talking to? Because that no, wasn't me. That's it. All right. Watch, no, watch, no, watch, I didn't watch say, last week's episode. You don't know Sam. shit. I said, oh wow, really? Because I was believing you and listening but to that's, you. That's not how she. All right. Cause. Are you gonna say what you want in a wife? <laughs> oh no, God. Did you find figure it out? I did. What would you like, Stephen? 
Shit, I forgot. I should have wrote it down. Uh, <laughs> well, you already said your pros and cons last podcast. You want her to be hardworking. You want her to be maternal, loving, affectionate. Yeah, that's basically it. So what the fuck are you talking about it again? We know already. Oh, oh, and she can't be like, she has to be able oh, to take a joke. Wear, and she can't wear fake eyelashes. Though. Yeah, I hate that shit. <laughs> Always have. really crazy. But um, <laughs> you said she, she she can't be sensitive. That was last week, too. You said that. I did say that? Yeah, she, she can't did. be sensitive? Yeah, yeah like, you like, know, because you know how I show, I show my love through joking on you. Me, too. Like, that's yeah. just me. Joking, honey. Oh, Cutting Like, ass. if I crack on you, that means I like you. Me, yeah, facts. <laughs> means I love you, actually. <laughs> like, if I don't crack on you like or anything how like hard that. are the cracks like what are we talking we're not, about we're not talking psychological <laughs> like, like your mother about? never loved your no. bum ass like that's no like, I gotta ask to see because i don't know what he means what do you mean by that what kind of cracks like your head too big like that so, type of stuff i mean I, like you know like i don't know did you use extra lotion on your forehead something like that <laughs> it's awfully shiny Hey. You know, I mean, so, sounds more like, like that. an observation. Oh, Lord, than Jesus. Like, is this crack. like a first date type thing, or what why are we not? talking about? Oh, see, why not? You, you just why do. can't it be? See, why? Why, why, why do you do everything in your power not to get laid? I'm just curious. <laughs> I just don't understand why. Are you are you, you afraid of the pussy? Are you date? afraid of the pussy? No. You're afraid of the, the pussy. pussy. <laughs> no. He's afraid of the pussy. It doesn't no. bite. It doesn't. It doesn't. So on a first date, you can kill a girl that she has It can't kill you. I'll just say it, you, you know, you've never noticed somebody's amazingly shiny forehead. I didn't Not realize really. that was one of my turn ons. You like big foreheads. And I, I, I can, you know, admire a nice, a nice forehead. You like quirky shit. The Cause you said you like middle? gap teeth or a something. A little bit of a gap tooth. And you said something else weird. Oh, you're if very, they have a list. Can I ask you, you're so, you're very, <laughs> very observant. Yeah. I notice everything. Yeah. Why? That's just how I am. See, I, I notice that about everybody. Uh, so you anal you overanalyze people. No day, every shit, day. I overanalyze everything. Like, it's a it's tough. a painful living fucking existence. I wish I wasn't like that. Okay, I wish you. to God I could just let shit be, mm. but I fucking can't. I can overanalyze too sometimes. More more, I'm emo uh, emotional checking. Like if. The energy in my mind feels like it's oh, different. Yeah. Like, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? Mm -hmm. But um, to overanalyze the person's appearance, I try not to do that. No, it's not even just. I don't like it. Uh, see, that's, <laughs> exactly. I, we talk about this I all the time. And I do but it to it's myself all right. day. It's just not fair because you guys just analyzed me. What do you mean? I no, apologize. No, you know you what? Said, I do. I apologize if I was saying something that no, made you feel any type of way. I was just saying you don't need to lose any more weight. You will look fine. Mm -hmm. And if your goal is to bulk up, then bulk up. If it's not, please just try not to lose any weight. Right. Any more no, weight. Just and, see, it up. and over analyzing is like what you just did when you said you want the girl to have like a kind of a gap and the her top lip is bigger than her bottom no, lip. No, I never said that. And I said a slight lisp is kind of sexy. Lisp. It's kind of cute. I, I, I never those are just I, like I never was little like, quirks I find cute. What? Oh, okay. 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 It's, I'm not saying if you don't have those things, oh, get out of here. But that's, oh, I don't know. That's a little over analytic, if that's a word to me. <laughs> well, what do you expect me to do? Because I'm just an average dude. Like I am the def. I then keep be a trying. Bad bitch. You working on it? You say you trying to lose weight. You trying to fucking bulk up? You gonna get a stylist? I'm not. You're definitely growing. Your, awesome. You're definitely growing your beard back. No, Please, I'm not. Lord Please. have mercy. Why? But like other than you, you little boy. Yeah. Aww. You are like, you guys you just like mad? A white, bunny. A white child. <laughs> are you guys just mad because I look? Yeah. And I had one of my coworkers ask how old I was because he thought I was in my mid twenties. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh please, he was lying. To you. He was man. trying to hit it. He was a young oh, first, shit. Well, first off, he was Damn. a young man. Uh, and he Thank you very matter. much. It don't Little matter. Teenager. They gay. All that's day. why he was asking exactly. how old you were. See if you're like, old yeah, That's you're not what it was. Thank you very much. Again, always got to take it further where ain't got to go. <laughs> he said all old, the time. He said old enough. <laughs> 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 How old was this kid? First off, they're minors. <laughs> oh, uh, sorry, okay. fucking sickos. How would I know that? I didn't know that until you just said it. Until you could wait for me to finish it. before you start going okay, into so your depraved teenager, diet some tribe. Some teenager gay boy tried to holler at you. At wow, and world. now you're just putting stuff on people That's like that. That's what you said. Why he asked you how old you was? Well, because I asked him how old he was. Why oh. are you trying to figure out? <laughs> 
I always ask how so old I everybody to, is. Why you so I know how to so appropriately you talk to around them. Out if he was okay, if he was okay, old enough to do something like there's what a method you, to his madness. There, exactly. See, this see, is that like, sounds crazy. Sam, you I don't know. I don't give a fuck. Ages. I don't give a fuck how shit sounds. I give a fuck about why it is. I say it because I want to know how I'm supposed to talk to the young man. If the young man is in his fucking twenties, I'm gonna talk to him different than he's in his, he's in his teens. What are you talking right, to him right, for? Right, right, right. Was he? Do you ask you something? Like I'm just confused. No, he's fucking new. You make him feel oh, welcome. He hey, how there. old are you? Oh, oh okay. Yeah, you, didn't, no, you, yes. left that whole, you left that whole part out. You, we thinking this is a random teenage gay boy coming up no, to you, Sam, asking you, you how old you are. You called them gay boys. To see you what's said good with you. Gay. See if you, you was said all home. this shit. Check your temperature, and you totally you put that on bypass me. Bypass that. He Nobody else there. felt like that. No one else <laughs> thought oh like my God, that. Ishi, did you not when he asked? <laughs> okay, so my thing when he was like, "How old are you?" I didn't know where the question came from. I thought you guys were just having a conversation. That's all. Yeah, oh, freaky yeah, I'm sorry. Ass We were at work. He's a coworker. Well, we didn't. Okay. Well, now we know. Good yeah. God, you fucking. I didn't think he was gay or anything. They just. This one over okay. here fucking always got to take it to the next level. And then she wondered why Brittany want to be missing podcasts. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Jesus. Not because of me. You're the one. Never mind. I'm not even going to put out there what you be saying. That's so, all please. Brittany only yelled at me one time. She's steady yelling at you. Oh, you call, you literally called her a slut. No, I didn't. You have slut shamed her constantly. No, I don't. <laughs> you don't realize you do it. You it, it's so like it comes. I'm up, so fucking wordy no, with it. It's amazing. No. I know exactly what she's saying because she said, "Don't get bad." Because I, I told Brittany, "Don't be mad at me because I'm single in my uh, in my canoe while she's trying to get a million motherfuckers in her rowboat." <laughs> no, you oh, said this is what you said. Okay. Now, Steve, wow, by, Steve, <laughs> slut shame. Wow. So Steve why? slut shames her. Slut he shame. slut shames her very smoothly to where she don't really get it get right it. away, and yeah. I, I be peeping it, and I'm slut like, shame. I don't know how she can get slut it. Shame. But he said the rowboat thing. He said, I'm not trying to have five or six niggas in my rowboat like you, Brit. <laughs> Lord, <laughs> what is wrong with dating? Like I don't know, that's slut shaming. You know, you know, women aren't allowed to date. In no, 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 because Ish. What? How many times on the podcast am I gonna have to listen to those two constantly telling me that I'm a no pussy getting ass bitch? That was so many years ago. Mm. I haven't called you. In, you called yourself a no pussy getting ass bitch more than I one. did the first time I said it. I just said I'm just. I I, I just said that. Eh, hey, you know, it's a little pussy. Yeah, whatever. Take it or leave it. I, I, I'm not mad <laughs> that you don't want to get laid. It's no, like, it's, I want to. I just don't want to have to work so hard. I mean, <laughs> you really you want to be fucking honest to with you. Put you in some it? effort I, for no, 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 no. Hold on. Let me, let's, let's I make this fucking that. clear. I wouldn't want to be a guy, Hold on, honestly, listen. Because you really got to put it they, on. Let's just make this clear, Sam. No, because he could easily get him an easy, that's not true. He could pay for it. He can get him an easy girl. It's not like it's impossible. You're just going to have to lower your standards, which you don't Why would do I do that when just, I know I well, can you pull want, it myself? You don't Why would get, I pay for no, it? No, I agree. I'm glad that you won't mm -hmm. lower your standards. Mm -hmm. But what I'm saying is not like men out here, and I'm 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 a. I'm a reach a little bit right here that need to feel like they need to coerce or assault women. It's like you don't need to do that. <sighs> what counts as assault? Like in terms of like you said, uh, what like do you mean? In like. I'm only asking just because now if you say, hey, girl, how are you looking pretty? Ah, oh, you're assulting me. That's not true. Um, I've never heard nobody are you ever serious? Say that. I think that's extreme. That's extreme. Yeah. That's her just get the fuck away from me, fucking creep. Yeah. <laughs> or trying to put you in jail. No, I, you know, most women who and, are oh, saying. So that's just water off the duck's back. Fast, uh, what I'm saying is most women who are saying don't play with that. Mi you know, misreputation of misrepresentation of rape shit. They don't do that. I would hope not. I would because hope it's in, hard for real cases to be taken seriously. I agree. Mm -hmm. That's why I think it should and be doubled I, when you find out them bitches yeah, are lying. I, I oh, absolutely. Too. Yeah. I do too. They need to go to jail. So yeah, they, can, they do. So, so ladies, yep. can y'all start leading the charge? What do you well, mean? that's the thing that we've been charge? saying for years. Why don't y'all lead it? It's against y'all, so why don't y'all lead it? Why we, try to tell, we try to tell the ladies, and you guys go, suck it up, buttercup. Why don't y'all do a protest down wherever the city hall or whatever like and stand up for your rights? 
No, no more live bitches. No, serious, because no, if seriously. you're a man that gets uh, um, accused. accused of that, it doesn't matter if you're guilty or not guilty. If you end up being non- not guilty, the damage is already done. That's you done fact. lost your job. People still think you did it. Mm-hmm. I would be protesting. Yo, I'll fuck you, you up if yeah. you lie to me. I'm not, I'm not with that. I'm not some, some brainless feminist that think that all women are right. Right. That's dead ass wrong. I would never want that to happen to my brothers right. or you, Steve, being falsely accused of something. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah. you'll see an ugly side of me if that ever happens. I promise. Well, I yeah. will fuck her up. Yeah. I mean, well, probably don't well, want to do that. Then it'll be what she said it was. Yeah. At that yeah. point. <laughs> then you'll so really maybe, go to jail. maybe don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> don't do that. See, that's not fair. Like, I can just have my whole, like, ah, see, women, that's where it is. I mean, women see, have now their it's whole, like, oh, Okay, no, so you're, no, no. you're talking about your representation. Men have my, their... Uh, representa- I'm sorry, your but reputation, my reputation rep- is... Is important. Is, is fucking way more important than your Absolutely, body count, ladies. But, but women, that's all I'm re- saying. Reputation is always trashed. You have, you have sex with, like, four people. The reason why women do that shit <laughs> is because they feel guilty reputation. that they're actually a hoe. No, what I'm saying is you what have is sex. A hoe? Right. You have sex. I don't, honestly, okay. each, I actually don't know what a hoe is you know, anymore. All right. So real fast. I like, need to know because. I really was, don't know what a hoe is. Do you guys is. know um, she's like one of those like misogynistic fucking podcast channels, just Pearl? Oh, she's a grifter. She's not a yeah, misogynist. That, so, she's a grifter. What is a grifter? A grifter is um, uh, a person who just hops on from different. T- she d- she doesn't have any of her own morals Political or values. Ideas. That she, her own ideas. Uh, she goes from so if, idea idea so, popular so, opinion so popular if it's opinion. It's Tuesday and it's misogyny Wednesday. She's going on whatever. She'll one. she'll play whatever it is that is going to draw. So right now it is, you know, Left-wing. go against it's yeah. it's go against the feminists and you know. Feminism is hoism to to yeah. the big thing now that they're trying. She so she's nerve. hopping on that right yeah. now. And I promise she you, had a she'll be on something yeah. else Mind you, in another three years. And, and the way she talks cracks me up because it's like she'll say women who are you know over thirty five have no value whatsoever oh, if you're not God. married with kids. But she looks forty eight and she's only twenty seven and she doesn't even have a man. Or kids. I'm just so tired so of this you're, conversation. You're, yeah, I know. I, know. I but agree. My point is, oh, why I brought that up, she had the nerve to make like a pyramid of hold, hold them. <laughs> and virgins were at the very top being so still but pure. I was like, so then. Wait, how can you be a virgin hoe? That's what I'm saying. Mm-mm. So that's what I'm making Isha's point. Like, who are hoes at this point? At if this virgins point, can be considered hoes, what is a hoe? Because they don't. Let's say a virgin. There's mo- a lot of virgins who never been penetrated and they have oral sex all the time. Mm. Is she a hoe now? I guess you could be a hoe with your mouth. But what is a hoe? What Just is, because you kind of okay. Say if you give the, people the blowjobs because you feel like giving someone a blowjob. Right. Why are you a hoe? Because you're giving blowjobs? I don't think that's But why does it like But you just said she's a hoe. Yeah. I just use hoe as a general statement. Just like I say nigga. So what do you, (laughs) but what do you, Steve, as a man, consider a hoe? Seriously. All right. If I had, all right. All right. She's a hoe. A girl you wouldn't date because you think she's a hoe. What do you consider? She's a hoe. Like, if she's like, if she like, if she fucks me or, and then goes and fucks another person that same day or that same night or right after. I think that's a little bit of hoe. Okay. Or vice versa, if it was the yeah. reverse happening. Are y'all together? No. So why? So but yeah. hold on, hold on, hold on. But that still can still count as hoism to me. A hoe oh, move. Okay. What about you? Me? Got you. What got about you. a hoe move? I like to call it that. A hoe mm-hmm. move. Hoe shit. You know how? Mm-hmm. I just said Men it. Men and women do hoe shit all the time. I just said it. I think. I, I, I think. I think a man. I think a man's a hoe for doing the same thing. Mm, if he fair. fucks one chick and then he goes and fucks somebody else, they say, that, that, "Yeah, you're a fucking hoe." Mm. To me, that's a hoe. Does that make that person a bad person? Is the no, question? Because uh, I, I hate being that a being hoe called d- a hoe is just equivalent to being a bad no, person. It seems no, no, like. no, no, no. Because here's my thing: you <laughs> I can just be don't a, understand how they're a hoe. Because you can be a hoe. <laughs> I don't understand why you're a bad person if you're a hoe. Because no. it's like if someone calls a person people, a hoe, no. they're people offended, just, and then they're t- they're telling people not to be around this person because they're a hoe. Was that were they fucking worshiping Satan? Like what? are they doing so wrong that they're bad mm-hmm. people like i don't get it people keep conflating sexual activity with personal choices and who they are morally in terms of how they view things mm-hmm. it's not the same thing you can be a hoe which is just somebody you it, again it's 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 a 
individual yeah. thing. Subjective, it's yeah. subjective. Yeah. It's however yeah. you fucking feel. I just think a hoe is somebody that tries to sleep with other people's men or is just trying to be messy. That's yeah. that's very I mean, hoeish. If yeah. you go from one person and decide to sleep with Tommy at night, that's your business. Why does? But why, I get what you're you saying. If you're intentionally having sex with p- women, men, whatever, significant others, just to be messy, there's no real nothing behind it. Yeah, or maybe you have a high sex drive. Yeah. I just don't know. Some people just have high sex drive. No, I, I, I understand that. <laughs> and if you're that. single, choke the chicken. You ain't got fucking thick. That's just people's business. Yeah. Like, yeah. They I, don't know. I always feel like I it doesn't understand. really affect me yeah, personally. Yeah, like it doesn't affect me as long as you're not sleeping with my person yeah. or but like, even going in around that, being messy. Like Even in that instance, it's like, what am I going to be mad for a hoe, essentially being a hoe or whatever you want to consider a hoe, when I should be, uh, you know, the person who lays next to me is what who owes me that mm-hmm. loyalty, not this person. Right. So I don't even be mad at the hoes or right, whatever right, you consider right. the hoes. No, seriously. Yeah. yeah. I'd be mad at the so person that you're with. with. Yeah, so you find that, that hoe loyalty. just starts trying to rub up on your... No, the, the thing is, it's a respect thing because then there's chicks who purposely have sex with your man because they don't like you and they rub it in your face. And then, then that requires them to get their fucking ass whooped. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? So, so, why does that go so it's true. <laughs> that's it. She got, it's true. She's like, what I'm saying is, like, it's yo, like that's when you gotta put okay, them fucking poetic justice up, in and movies, be the bitch ass. Shit. Growing up watching shit, you Lifetime, whatever movies, hood movie, whatever, the guy would get caught with the girl and then the girl's trying to beat on the other girl. Mm-hmm. And I never understood why. Right. And I'm like, that bitch man, don't owe you nothing. The man literally yeah, stepped he, out on you and disrespected yeah, you. Yeah, he the one who yeah. lays with you every night. Yeah. Well, I mean, but then men do is, the same there's shit. There's exceptions when a girl, when another girl's damn near harassing you. You got chicks posting about other girls. Oh, <laughs> Sorry. Thanks, thanks, Maggie. Thanks, thanks. Fucking asshole. <laughs> That tail is so fluffy. Oh my god! All right. All right. So relax, relax, relax. All right. What was that? Ew, you stink. Jesus <laughs> um, ADD much? Yeah, mm-hmm. I lost it. <laughs> now you know how I feel when you interrupt I me. I lost it too. Shit. <laughs> Did you catch it? Startled us. All. Dude, honestly, it's almost like white noise. I kind of just toned it oh out. Oh my <laughs> god! So, I was, so you trying to say I wasn't spitting? I know we're talking about that holes. Not but really. Uh, how you feel? Well, all I know is we just I just want to get back to the days where, you know, where <laughs> hoes were, you know, more stealthily with their hoes. You mean more subtle, more subtle. That's all we've talked about. That. Does anybody it need to know? I, here's my thing. I I don't need to know that you like people. So po- all right. So I think podcasting and like those shows that we talked about, the pop balloon shit has like really put a, a real bad perception on I don't know people are just too free to just talk you know what I gotta hold that thought cause I have to like work through this so okay. we gotta take a break We're back. Real fast, I got a, I have a TikTok idea that I'm gonna do probably in a few weeks, and it made me think of a movie that we've all watched that we all love. Friday, right? We all love that Which movie. Which one? All of them. All the Fridays. Uh, all right. What's your favorite Friday then? The first one. No, me actually, too. I me go too. front. The third one. I kind of like the second. Really? I kind of do. Okay, but my thought, all right, I'm, you know me, I randomly start thinking of shit or content to myself, and I realize that Ice Cube's character, Craig, is awful person. Craig. Why? He's terrible. Break he, this down. How, why? In the first Friday, he's lazy as fuck. He lost his job. He got fired on his day off. Who the, how the fuck does that even happen? Hold on, I almost got fired on my day off. For stealing boxes. <laughs> Like, oh, and then he smokes. He has no job and proceeds to smoke stolen weed with his dumbass pothead friend. Smoke it. His, he's always in the kitchen trying to eat some shit. Don't put no money in there. He didn't throw out the trash. Remember his dad told him to throw out the trash that night. He didn't do it. OK. The second one, you're going to steal from Pinky. You don't know this nigga. He didn't steal from Pinky. He, oh, sorry. He stole from Little Joker. Little Joker. You stole from some Mexican niggas you ain't even know. They could have killed your ass. You put your whole family 
I in Jeopardy, <laughs> yeah, but, his fam- but they, they didn't stop him. They and knew you what was happening. Ta- Wait, hold on. You couldn't even take one for the team, Craig, and fuck with Lil D so that she wouldn't put a fucking break through Day Day's car. Craig, Craig. Wait, ain't first off, whoa, shit. whoa, whoa. Now whoa. let's go to the oh, third. The Janet Jackson girl. No, uh, no, that, no, no. That the was second, uh, the second one. Oh, okay. the, yeah. She's the girl. The girl she's talking about is the one who's saying, "I get rough and tough, tough with, with my, my Afro." Puff. Lady of Rage. <laughs> Lady of Rage. That's it. Anyway, Rage. let's move on to the third one. They they both get a security job. Don't do nothing. They don't do their job. They sit around all fucking day and smoke weed. They don't do shit. Can't even pay their fucking rent. They then, they throw, their then they throw an illegal. No, the third one. Yeah. Cause the reason then, why- the, then they throw in a legal house party with weed and fucking hookers. Child, it's hard working for the man. Listen, off, Craig is a terrible person. <laughs> I fucking stand by what he what I say. He's terrible. He ain't, he had a different bitch every fucking Friday on top of it. So you mad that he has <laughs> he's options? He's selfish. No, he's fucking. I don't know how you don't see the character breakdown. He's fucking selfish and lazy. I gotta watch it again. And we love him so much as a character. Alex Smokey, he's hilarious and the dad. Mm-hmm. First, of, I just, I just, I just I don't know, see where you're coming peace. from. You know? I, I don't see because that where was the... one whole day. That's crazy. All that happened in one day. But you're see, so you're thinking about the first one, right? Yeah. No, I'm but the second the one took one. place like basically almost like a week or so after. Right? Supposed to, next yeah. Friday. Yeah. <laughs> like <laughs> literally <laughs> next Friday. It was, it, it was a week after. Oh, but I'm mean. saying to each like the first one, just break down how he acted in the first one. I'm gonna he have slammed to watch the it again. door in the Jehovah Witness bitch's face early in the okay. morning. Okay. Question. Rude is that? Have never. you ever? I, <laughs> yes. Uh, here you go. Story. I actually got into a debate with one. Oh, I changed his life. What are you talking about? Oh, the Jehovah's Witness. No, he Witness. went right back to the oh, fucking Jesus. kingdom. Right, Hall, I was nigga. like, you ain't yo, changed nobody's life. I, man, we had a two. We had an hour conversation at that oh, front door. No. I made that motherfucker tap. Oh hell no! I'm not doing you picked all the that. wrong. House. Well, they don't believe in hell, so I don't know what. They hey, do. <laughs> all I know is he never he came back. He wants you to go somewhere. I just they don't never know came where. back to the fucking house. I'm ever. just saying he's a mouthy. Craig man. is terrible. Craig, I don't think so, bro. He's a bum. No, bad boy was a bum. Was Tyrese in that movie? Like, oh yeah, he was yeah. A bum. yeah. Jody, <laughs> my nigga Jody. Man, no, he was right. a, no, that was another thing. He was another terrible character. Yes. My thing is the the main characters, the male and tag uh, uh, protagonists or whatever. Mm-hmm. They're ba- they're terrible people. Yeah. Is what I'm saying. Sometimes we when you for watch stuff back. Uh, yeah, when you watch yeah. it back, I'm like, yo, Craig was right. a lazy, terrible. He was cheating on his bitch, even yeah. though she was cheating on him too. But I'm just saying. Remember when Neil Long came through? Neil Long. He I didn't mean, know, but he didn't know that Joy was cheating on his girl. He didn't know, right. and then he all over Neil Long, all in her face and shit like that. Ain't I'm sorry. I mean, that's Do you Nia remember Long. Prime Nia Long? <laughs> you're, t- you're missing the point. You're missing the fucking point. Nine. That's when Ho Steven comes out. Okay, Steve. <laughs> okay. I'd be a hoe for her. Are you out of your mind? Oh you so fucking hoe, kidding me? And a hoe, you would be sleeping with her. Is that what we're saying? Then we're going to be two ho hoes. <laughs> ho ho ho. You can call us the ho ho twins. I don't give a fuck. You miss the whole twin. I just think you're over. See, I didn't overanalyze. I, gotta I think you so. gotta watch it again. I'm serious. When I watch, watch Girlfriends, yeah. that I, when I watched that series back, I could see how some of them were bad friends. I'm like, damn. Especially Tony. Yes. Selfish. Okay. Horrible. So, so, so if we're gonna talk about bad people, here we go. Oh, and, here Carrie, go. and Carrie Bradshaw, she's an awful person. Here we go. Janet Texas Jackson. City. Why did I get married too? Oh, here we go. Well, yeah, yeah. She was wrong. She was dead. She wasn't. I mean, hold on. No, 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 no. Because mm-hmm. each each set me off too. Because she knew I was gonna get mad at them. She made me watch that fucking rock. movie. And I, she's like, that was, that was such a random. Goes, that was a lot going on. It really though. was. She they goes, lost a child, and then she. But that was so. She that was her much, fault. Though. So check this out. She, it was her fault for the kid. She's a bad person. Oh, don't say it was. Her it, fault. It's unfortunate. No, that was her fault. Yeah, that, no. I said it. See, now you sound Do like something. her husband. That, that said but it was. It was. Her fault. And then it was her fault. That he got in the fucking accident. I mean, yeah, she shouldn't have went to his job. She went to his job right and said he was gay or something. She's she, oh, she sent like a wait. That a was cake. the end when he, they already they were the, divorcing, right? She sent a, like yeah. a cake with like a gay guy. In you know what cracks like me up about remember. Tyler Perry? I, listen, Tyler Perry. You know we've we've had our issues and we still. I don't know why you don't like his movies. Why? Yeah, why good. today did I see a new movie by you with Megan Good and she's getting beat? Like, why is all your movies wrapped around women, like black women struggle and getting beat and abused? Like, why? 
I, just talk to me here, Tyler. So I you're just, just looking for a little, no, uh, you know, this, role reversal. He makes the same movies, is what I'm saying. They're well, well, always the same what fucking What new fucking movie. ideas are there really out but, there? But why? <laughs> Seriously. It's not about well, no, 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 new no, no, ideas. Sam, come on. Like, why do we always got to be about the Sam, struggle? Two yeah. Godzilla movies came out the same fucking week. There's no new ideas. There's no new shit. That's not true. I think it's just been over the years. Hasn't it been like a decade now? Oh, More well over that? a decade. For, oh, Tyler? for Tyler God, Perry. yeah. So, it's yeah. probably like 20 now. Yeah. And it's always the same shit. I'm like, why what? is this? What do you want him to make? A fucking space no, cowboy you know, movie? What? What? Yes. <laughs> yes. Cowboy. Please make a black space cowboy. I don't cowboy even know what he movie. would make. It's because, I mean, even the shows that he has. I don't really they're watch the, the shows. Same, but House of Pain is dope. I'm sorry. I thought that was great. I don't know what he would do. I mean, he's still making that money. I don't even know I, what he I just do. I watched it and I'm like, is he trying to make this shit like enough? Wait, what about okay, hold on. Remember enough by Jim? What about Ooh, 50 yes, Cent? I do. That shit was terrible, by Gangsta. the way, as you watch it. Hey, no, that, that movie was terrible. It's what, good, one? but it's terrible enough. Oh. Her acting in it cracks me I up. I liked every it at time the time, time probably. No, when watch it. she beat movie, the shit out of it, yeah. Where she's like, like learning how to fight. But yeah. then when you rewatch it, yeah. you're like, uh, you yeah. Look, she can't beat him. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like, she, <laughs> yeah. Right. And I was like, so she committed premeditated murder. Okay. Basically, yeah, that's exactly okay, what it was. Got it, got it. So they're, not gonna, so they're not gonna, so not they're not gonna find the cell phone blockers and the, then the messages of her. Word, trying she turned to into kill fucking Batman. Dead ass. Sometimes you watch those things back, you're like, what? What? And her <laughs> acting when he hit her the first time, he's like, I can't hit you. She's like, No, you can't. Oh I was my like, god. J Lo, you could have the queeniness. <laughs> you could have gave it a little bit more. You could have made it come a little bit more. <laughs> I'm just saying, man. I don't know what y'all looking for. Because what Fifty Cent, all he does is gangster shit. You stick to those rivers and those lakes I don't sometimes, watch that Sam. Either. That's true. No, me neither. Like, I, like the shit gets old after a it while. Does get like, yeah. How many fucking times? Know me. How I many watch, ti- How many different ways can a motherfucker a, flip a brick? Yeah, I right. have no idea. I like superhero. You I'm know me. Done. I like superhero shit, science mm-hmm. fiction shit, and that's always different. The formulas are. I know what you're saying. Sometimes the formulas are the same. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? Like Dune. You, did you watch Dune? No. Mm-hmm. Oh, it was good actually. But there was a show on Apple. Plus, that was foundation. It was like the same fucking thing about an empire and mm. keeping the empire and the small people. It'd be all the same. Like Star Wars, the same thing. That rise of the empire. They're all kind of the same thing. Oh God, yeah. these new ones that came out are. Oh no, they're terrible. Awful. Uh, even though, uh, Al- Alkalite, Alkalite. I think I gotta finish oh, yeah, that. Oh yeah, I wanted to watch it's that. A, it was okay so yeah. far. It wasn't. It wasn't the Mandalorian. Y'all gonna see the new Deadpool? <laughs> The You're gonna yeah. see the new Deadpool? Absolutely. I guess. I'm excited. I can't yeah. fucking wait. I'm excited. Seeing I'm gonna go that, that night. I wanna go I'm to ups, the man. I'm gonna get good and high. And Is it, oh, it's coming out on HBO or Disney? The 23rd. Or it's coming out the 27th in theaters. Okay. Oh, so, yeah. I don't know. I'm going to, I'm going to go to the theaters to watch I'm it. I'm going right to my usual spot. You know I love... You know um, X-Men is my favorite cartoon of all time. I don't know if I ever so, explained it. Do you want me to give you a spoiler warning? Oh, um, hold on. I think I know already. Pi- like who's gonna be in it? No, I'm talking about uh, what it could, pot- what the new Deadpool potentially might lead into. Blade. Yes. No. Well, I th- heard no, that one. Th- maybe they're still trying to find a director. Uh, oh my god! Wait, the movie's already done. No, they're talking about. No, she's talking about Blade. But no, I heard Blade was gonna be yeah, in Deadpool. I Possibly. Was- well, no, Wesley Snipes might be. Mike, yes, I thought yes. he was. No, sure. I thought for sure he was in. That's yeah, that's the you rumor. Know what sucks? I, hope so. I, I wish he didn't get old. <laughs> he was the perfect blade. He really Yo. was. And he Every was, time the Blades movie, that oh, was just like a. The well, dude, Blade saved Marvel. He did. People forget yeah, that. Blade saved Marvel. They never I think say nobody that. Nobody says it, and it's so they true. Never said that. They never he said and that. he looked. Great as Blade, yeah. fit Blade. Yeah, well, because he, he's a real badass, yeah. he can he really, really does, fight. He does martial mm-hmm. arts. It was either honestly like him or like a Michael Jai White. Because no, he's a yeah. real why, fighter. He said, I think yeah. he, he said why he didn't want to do it. I think he said he was too old or something like that. Mm-hmm. But he would have been perfect, actually. Yeah. Yeah. They got yeah. the other guy. Um, I forget his name. Mahershala Ali. Yeah. He's going to be good. No, he's going to be good. He's be great. He's going to be really he good. Was in, um, he was in Luke Cage when he played Cottonmouth or whatever the, the villain's oh, name was. He was really good. But what they're saying yeah. is the Deadpool no, shit is going to lead into the new X Men movies. 
Mm-hmm. Good. Wait, say it again. They're about so. Oh, they're gonna. Are, so you think they're, they're gonna get new, it. like totally new actors? Dude, you have no idea. There's the, the whole shit that's about to happen they with Marvel, to- with all the shit that they're about to come out with. Mm-hmm. I'm fucking excited. Honestly, it's giving me back in the day vibes. Yeah. To where right. I'm actually excited, excited yeah. for, the sh- for these the movies movie. to I come hope, out I and hope, how they're all gonna interchange gonna and shit like, like that. Yeah. I hope that they mm-hmm. keep um the new the younger versions of. uh Magneto and Charles Xavier. Those two it's actors. It's all recast. No. Ooh. They're those, all getting those, recast. Those are the only two people I want them to keep out of, <laughs> out of this. Because I don't really like any of the newer X-Men movies. They got it all fucking... Honestly, real talk, I love X-Men. I, don't, I think I can't make that point enough. I love it. I know the comics. I know almost everything. The movies have been bad. I love them because I'm a kid. They're nostalgic, but they get it all wrong. They made Rogue so weak. Mm-hmm. She's like actually like... Omega level mutant. Mm-hmm. Cause she absorbed like Miss Marvel, which those Marvel movies suck too. Those Miss Marvel movies. She absorbs her I, powers. No, you know, I right? disagree with you. <laughs> Miss the the first uh the Marvels, yeah. I'm sorry, was a good fucking movie. Mm, I, I don't care uh-huh. what nobody you know, says. She, she kills she absorbs her power. That's how she becomes super strong. Yes. Rogue. She absorbs all her power. Yes. So she can go through she can go yeah. up to space and travel through space and all that shit. Yeah, because she, she absorbed it to the point she, um, what's her name? Carol Danvers was in mm-hmm. a coma. Still, I gotta rewatch all these because I be mm-hmm. I be forgetting what the hell yeah. Watch the old, on. actually watch the old X Men cartoon because on Disney Plus and watch the new one. That shit was X Men ninety seven. That shit was too good. I was like, the writers was writing. Mm. <laughs> they was writing. Yeah, they already they already got the new t- um they already got the next Season two seasons two? already. Oh yeah, Dang. ready There's, to go. I cosplayed as um. Oh, nice. Yeah, you yeah, think. <laughs> I cosplay as, uh, was it Madeline Pryor? That one got mad love. Nice. Yeah. Because that's Jean Grey's clown. Oh, I, just, I just can't you know. wait. This is, I can't. Why don't you ever do Comic Con or something like that? You, you know what it is? Honestly, I'm just not that brave. Nor am really? I. Uh, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a big it's sissy when it comes to certain shows. Really? Like yeah. I really am. I know. Okay. I, I do you feel you silly? Don't Dragon Ball Z it up a little bit. Because if I do, I want to do it right. Then do yeah. it right. Like I want like a legit. Like that's the reason why. Yeah. Like I don't like Halloween like that. Because mm-hmm. like I want my you're costume. Prob- but you, to be, if this is you. You wait last minute. You could yeah, get one hundred percent. You're correct. Yeah, you can definitely. Plan. You can plan. You know, I mm-hmm. already know what I'm gonna be for Halloween. I can tell you right like, now. Like to this day, I still want to pull off trunks. You can do it. What trunks? That costume's easy to get, Steve. Too. Okay. You should know who that. We're not talking. Um, yeah, wait, y'all know any? Dragon? No, she should know this. She, she should you know watch this. Anime? She should know. No, nah, she should not know. Like that. Our cartoons. She does, she like does. That. I tried. I watch and a lot of she marriage refused. shows. A lot of marriage shows. Yeah. Child. <laughs> she, child. Oh, you love the drama, don't you? Not really. I just like the way people act. It's so funny. Oh, okay. It's like I want to get married. The first argument, I need a divorce. I'm like, yo. <laughs> so you like uh, was it marriage at first sight? Type marriage shit. at first sight. Love is blind. I yeah. like. I like the polygamy Did, show. That one is great. Oof. I love it. Did oh you God. ever see? Oh, you ever seen Seeking Sister Wives? Yeah, Seeking Sister. That's what oh I'm God. talking about. I love it. The Snow Dance. You know who they are? The, is it the, the black one? couple. Oh yeah, they are very interesting. I I did kind of a deep dive on them. They're a mess. Like they have. Yeah, like, they seem like they are. He's like a scammer and they had like a couple girls like marry them mm-hmm. and then like run away i want to know i want to know, like, know what did, going on i want to know what he does for work because the way he they it, be moving he doesn't he, they work. went from atlanta to california yep. and they bought a house yeah with one room for one girl and the other room he, for another. i'm like how you where's and the they money got mad kids from? and yeah. he works at home i'm like damn what he do yeah maybe it's inheritance I don't, I don't know because his mother doesn't really mess about with him, him like that. Yeah, it's something about like he was messing, not messing with sexually or doing. Mm-hmm. He was kicking it with like this white couple that had money, but I don't mm-hmm. know exactly the in and outs of what was going on. Yeah. Like, I think he was borrowing money from them all the time. Yeah, he, with, with people, with him, you could tell he's a narcissist and they're mm-hmm. master manipulators. So he was just mm-hmm. manipulating everybody. It was just so interesting, and he wasn't attractive. So I, I was trying to so figure either. out what he. I think his it's wife fact, was beautiful. Oh yeah, I think it's the fact of being taken care of. I think like if you don't got to work i yeah. think sometimes but it's like even, oh my god but the first wife that they had i never understood because she had no kids like, yeah like i understand and she jumped right in re- jumped i understand the thought of polygamy when um all parties have kids all right because mm-hmm. it's like a village like mm-hmm. one of my really good friends she's got three kids mm-hmm. and she was dating a guy who was 
kind of trying to convince her to get in polygamy and she considered it mm. because she's a single mom and has right. no help and she's right. like you know i almost consider it because it's like it is like a village, village yeah. and everybody takes care of each other and then i i talked to her the fuck out of that mm -hmm. but like mm -hmm. in that aspect i can kind of get it mm -hmm. but when you're just a single woman mm -hmm. coming into a polygam polygamous uh, coming into a relationship right with, with kids. kids already it just seems like you're a babysitter yeah that's and that's what i think some of her family were concerned about because she's like okay so this she wants to start her own business the other wife it's like so what are you going to be doing cooking and taking care of the kids and i think yeah that's kind of like that's what exactly it was yeah. but yeah. And she said bye yeah she's in the middle of the night and they, did, they had such a beautiful ceremony they look really nice yeah. their outfits and everything but it's just so interesting i'm like wow would y'all would y'all date or obviously you guys are already involved yeah. uh would you allow your man to be a stay-at-home dad uh, like how stay at homey exactly how it fucking sounds <laughs> it depends i mean like I, I mean like is it depends like if, 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 if he's a master it, chef a cleaner and like okay right? okay hold on no let's right? break this down now okay it depends okay it depends. this is great okay so so you so to say you're the main breadwinner sam Right, you popping. Yeah, you out in the street. You fucking getting these checks. You getting. It depends on what I'm doing. If I'm working twelve hour shifts, right? Like, no. Yeah. It, it has to, to be something along the lines. If I, if okay, I, if hold on. Like, no, wait, wait. But if it's like Tabitha, I don't know. You probably don't know Tabitha Brown's story and no. her husband. I love her. Of what they were grinding together for mad long, and she actually ended up retiring her husband because they didn't. She's so she didn't need to work anymore. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. I understand. So Steve, if let's but say if, if I'm popped, slaving, no. yeah. If I popped off with my cosplay stuff. Yeah, mm -hmm. and all I really needed Colt was to be my road dog, and we, you know, he's my protector, and we, and we would go all these different money. comic cons, right. and I'm making all the absolutely. Yeah, but if like each said, I'm fucking working at, you know, a hospital or something, fucking mm -hmm. 15 hours a day, mm -hmm. and he's not doing shit. Hell no, that's mm -hmm. not fair. Wait, but what if he's taking care of the house, the kids? You I come can... home, food is ready. Well, I mean... hold, I, hold on. Food is ready. Kids are taken care. I'm talking about. He's like really. They holding down the house only for a little you get while. Your foot rub. Okay. Okay. Like if he w would if, you be if a housewife? Hard times hit. Would you be a housewife? No. Why I not? need to do something. Something. I, I'm yeah. curious. Yeah. I'm wondering when this died because I think like well, see, the remember idea, we talked about the the well, era I know of the that housewives we, and them not being I, I, psychologically I, well. That, that's where a lot of like I think Xanax that's from other things depression. though. And, and um, Prozac came from their depression was so bad they didn't realize it, and a lot of them were harming themselves, committing suicide, harming the kids. Like, okay, that can we can we agree that it was, could possibly it be wrong. a different Valiant. time and <laughs> yeah. that now that we have a better understanding of everything that obviously they would probably have a hobby or something. Well, I'm not one talking of my about, friends. Okay, bitch, one of my friends, I want you in that house every day. Well, if I don't motherfucking have yeah. my hot plate when I get home, bitch, there's knuckle sandwiches <laughs> well, being passed see, out. That's if, not what I'm talking about. Say, what I'm saying is, is like, hey, babe, you know, hey, thanks for holding down. You know, hey, go spa day. Go, go. Something like um, that. Well, one of my friends right now, she's not working. She's a stay-at-home mom and she's on antidepressants. So That's <laughs> different, Sam, because I she's not depends. working. Depends. I'm talking about if she is. I'm talking about the shit is taken care of. She's comf. You are comf. You have the house. You ain't got to worry about she, the shit. All yeah, your job is yes just to take no, I'm care of the she's house. She's being taken care of. That's what I'm trying oh, to tell you. And she, yes, and she's not mentally well. Oh, okay. It's okay, only okay. so much of like I'm cooking and cleaning. You could if do. I have my farm and he's working, shit. Yeah. But you're still doing something. But you're yeah, doing I would something. Have to do something. She's a full time stay at home mom. Like just take only stays at house, take care of the kids. That's a lot. Yeah, it's a lot of work. That's a lot. And mentally. it's a lot of. I don't know. It just feels like repetitiveness, nothingness to me. Because remember when I was out of work for that long? That's all I would do is like kind of clean the house and I was like oh, man, she was excited she's like I ain't fucking work I ain't doing shit but, after, but then I got into, but then I got into my to hobby into, so right. that yeah if you have a drive to do that but no uh, well hold that thought cause right, we, we gotta, gotta take, take a break, break. And we're back. Wait, Steve, so you could be a stay-at-home husband? Yeah, why not? 
I can entertain myself. Take care of those little what, fuckers. All right. What about no kids and you just stay at home boyfriend? What if you were in a narcissist? This is what I mean. Steve has never been in a. I try to get him to kind of understand a narcissistic, toxic relationship. Yeah. It's very, you know, it's very <laughs> traumatizing. It's it's it's. I'm still traumatized. Okay, to this day so before. here's my thing. But what I'm saying is, I, what if you were in that kind of what, wouldn't happen? No. You, oh my god. Uh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> whoa, whoa, what happened? Okay, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Get your you, shit off, Ish. Hold on, yeah, because she no, wants to say No, because like you with relations, I try not to say too much because you're still in fantasy land, and I, I, I disagree you act with like you. a narcissist is gonna come around and act like a narcissist no, to your face. They, they gonna clearly they don't. you and act like a, the greatest thing on earth, and then it's gonna hit you at some point. Real bad. You gotta realize people stuck. are actors until they're not. I understand that. You could you could stay with somebody for a whole year and then wha. Two years, three years, 40 years, 20 years. You just don't know. People are fickle. Yeah. Human beings. Just think of every human beings are can whatever it is possible for them to do. It can happen. Trust so. me. No one's more yeah. pessimistic than I am. Ish. Trust me. I know that. But I just want hold you on, to. Hold you're on. so blessed. You're not just to so fairy tale. Come across it's that. Like, yeah. Oh, Lord Jesus. Because it's so traumatizing. And, and Sam, not so when you're dream. the realest nigga in the room, no bullshit can be there. I am That's, the light. Uh, no darkness really can come. Look, first off, the see realist, how, really? Well, you know. Mm. Oh, I'm sorry. It's Each my just confidence. To you. It's my confidence. She just explained to you. You'll meet a narcissist that seemed like the godliest, most of your dream, and then she will turn into the worst person you ever met, a devil. The a devil leech. himself. Because that's what you are. You're a, a supply for them. Mm -hmm. Energy you are nothing being. more than just supply. Mm -hmm. I understand that. I get that. So I'm telling you, this is, this is <laughs> they're the worst kind of people to ever run into. And you run into them more than you think. I mean, look, mm -hmm. I guess I've just been blessed and lucky. I haven't had that. No, and I, but great. I, w great, but it's like, I told I, you, I only, I just try, I only to, I try to get you to kind decent of people. sympathize or empathize, empathize with women who've been through or at that, least I try. the Cassie thing, or when I've expressed, you know, why reasons sometimes women don't walk away, it's because of this, this, and you're like, nah, that wouldn't be me, and they could have walked the fuck away. Everybody police, says blah, 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 what blah, blah, they would have did, exactly. should have did, would have did, but they ain't in a relationship. Everybody's a could have, would have, should have. <laughs> could have, would have, should have. They ain't had the situation that but happened. As it's pessimistic so as I am, is it not healthy? Do you understand how hard I have to try to not quit on humanity. Mm. Welcome like, to the party. Are, I'm like, trying what are you real about? hard. I'm the one on here who openly has said, if there really was an infinity line, I wouldn't think twice snapping half of you fuckers out of here. I wouldn't Including even hesitate. Yourself. If I'm not worthy, I'm out of here too. Nobody's though. worthy. No one's perfect. Look, no one could determine All I'm saying is, I, if I could, yeah. I would just do this. And then and I include think yourself. That's not true. Include yourself. No, I'll make it so it's not me too. Why? Because you're perfect. And did you not see no. Thanos at the end of that? That nigga was fucking down bad. Like, because it he almost no killed him. <laughs> no, it wasn't just that. He had no, after That's he what made that is. goal, right? After he 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 accomplished that goal, he had nothing else. What are you talking to about? Do. He had a retirement home. You didn't see him he sitting was there. He sat on his. He was port. alone. He did. That's What's what he the wanted. Worst thing? What's the worst thing in the fucking world for any That's what thing he wanted, in the Sam. world? Sam. Is That's what he wanted. Alone. You, what he sat there, Sam. He sat down he saw that sun come up and he fucking smiled He's and he said a great, i don't know a what you grateful. watched know. But it's at the very end of the movie sam you're talking about. people to be alone oh, exactly whoopee. we're okay and, and i don't know, know how you know read it. It. technically it wasn't this a slaughter this is how you know perception Didn't he slaughter them blue people well, yeah, okay. but you know, yeah. this how you, you know, know perception yeah. is is just different for everyone because I've so seen different. at the end that he had nothing. That's why he nothing. didn't care that Thor killed him. Sam, but why don't you off yourself instead, like he, of see, doing again, all what he had to do? What was he trying to do? He was trying Save to bring something. balance to the yeah. to the world. And then yeah. how are you going to do that? You know, you snap Again, away half like the we people. just said, mm -hmm. how do you determine who's yeah. worthy and who's not? Exactly. And that's why you it's can't at random. Oh, okay. But that doesn't make it any better. The rapture. Right. <laughs> no, that's technically, well, yeah, technically it's at random. That, that's the rapture. <laughs> yeah, I guess you could. But not half, of, but when the rapture happens, it's not going to be half. It's going to be less. Oh, great. It's, it says it in the Bible. Awesome. Everybody fucking knows that. You really so think. So when, when, when you get snapped up to heaven, we just stay here, the bad people? I think that's like how it's supposed 
po- so like on some, uh, some according fucking to the Left Behind shit. movies. Oh my Which god! Movies? No, you're the Left not. Behind movies. No, you're not. Yes, I am. No Left Behind. Yes, movies. I am. Left Behind. Don't listen oh, to me, these are first off. They're great I've cheesy never movies. Heard of these? They're movies. great. They're Christian cheesy movies. Christian movies. Not Christian movies. I love movies. them. I love those. Wait, movies. hold on. There, I don't. There's post-apocalyptic Christian movies. Yeah. Oh yeah. A whole bunch of them. A whole, a whole bunch. series. Even books that go with yeah. them. Yeah. What the fuck? Mm, well, listen here. I'm just, I'm just realizing Precious Moments was Christian. Like, what am I missing right now? Whole, but in the movie, or Catholic actually. I think yes, Catholic. people <laughs> got just instantly blinked away. And like on some Stephen King shit. The rest of the world had. That's when the Antichrist rised up, <laughs> and he took. He was just. He was a white. He was a Brit. baddie. <laughs> he was a white Brit. Everybody knows that the white devil is a British person. That's why I don't I know why they. I don't. All, I don't know I, why those fuckers are so uppity and they act like they didn't I, do they shit. They are uppity. I can't stand. I've been it. trying to tell y'all this shit for years like, that y'all Europeans have are assholes done the worst like that in history. And more than you, the nerve. <laughs> the nerve. And, and they y'all got, the, got nerve. the nerve to be like. <laughs> and they got the nerve to talk about America and our problems. Yes. Oh, we got Please. ours. But don't get it twisted. They have so much blood on their hands. It's <laughs> not even funny. Act like they didn't do shit. They're still the head of state or mad at them islands. Jamaica and all of them. Please. Wait, I thought they, um, I thought Jamaica. Well, they're China. independent, but the head of state, like the, oh, yeah, the head of okay. like, their legal and courts and stuff like that. But yeah, those those movies, that's exactly it's actually the it exact called? same. The left behind. I'm look I'm gonna look oh, this yeah. shit up. Watch the first one. It's actually not that bad. <laughs> I don't know what it's not that bad each. I don't even remember them. I just know I they do. were scary. <laughs> It's like, oh, am I so gonna be left? came through? Was there cursed in sex? No, no. I think was it, were they persecuting the Christians? They yes. were beheading them, right? They were. They, you, you were set <laughs> this in the is camps. A Christian. Yes. This is y'all people shit. Yes. Well, it's in the Bible. It says it's in it. the Bible. It says it. It's gonna happen. It's in the it Bible. Me a handmade cell. Every time I read, I it, love like, oh. It's all based off Revelation. So people who are left here Revelation. have a chance. To te- cause technically, yeah, they're the rapture, but then there's the second coming, which is when God comes down and that's the battle between the Antichrist and God. And that's Why when we gotta be that's here a lot. That's uh, how did I get in? So you get another chance <laughs> to be like basically it's like your final like yo judgment. Hoorah. It's like, yo, if you don't realize what's happening and you fall victim to the mark of the beast, if you fall victim to this, if you get engulfed in their ideology. Right. You're gonna end up in the lake of fire in hell. Well, from or you're gonna end up in the lake of fire, which is separate from hell, which people don't really realize. Well, from hell is just hell. a holding place. Oh, but what am I doing in hell though? Like kicking it, or it's like you're 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 suffering? you're you're suffering. When the death, Nikki, I want to go to hell. Oh, it's, hell it's, not a, it's not a <laughs> no, party it's like a in Little like, Nikki. Like, no, like like that's what I always think. Or it's like not like Little Nikki. I want to tote guns and shoot dice. It helped. Um, so it's not yeah. a party? No, and it's not no a party. Like demon it's not a party. It's not a party. It's not a party. All right. Oh, like Little Nas X? <laughs> yeah, 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 like a pole. No. It's not like what, that. You know, that sucks because I feel like I'm going to go to hell, man. That fucking sucks. I don't think so. I be saying some fucked up shit. I don't think you should. I, 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 and I be thinking some fucked up shit. Right see, this is where, all, though. But this is where I differ from people, especially in Christianity. It's like, okay. You can be a murderer, you can repent, and then you can live good. Yeah. And what, you get to go to heaven because you said, I'm sorry and shit like my that? Bad. But if I'm just out here cussing and shit, and I happen to die, but I didn't go, my bad God, I get to automatically get, go to hell? Yeah. Is there, I don't, is there, like, I don't think like it's that. that. I, I, I definitely, I used to think that, but mm. uh, now it's like, I really think it's who you are you know as a heart, person. So. Like, if you're out trying to do bad if you're trying yeah. to hurt hurt people, if you're trying to be a dick and deceive people and do all this shit, yeah, you get your just desserts. That's fair. You reap what you <laughs> sow. <laughs> your just desserts. Yeah, you let that, that sounds see, good. I, I know, right? I, and right, yeah. No, we're not. We're done. We're not yeah, done. Yeah, we are actually. See, yeah, you, she's always trying to just. Come. Niggas got shit to do. St- I'm sorry, yeah. producer was late. Oh, don't do that. Shots he fired. really hard. Do something. Ping, 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 ping. I know. It doesn't mean I can't fuck with him. I'm going to fuck don't with him. Don't fuck with him. I'm going to. Nigga. Damn. Do something. Y'all are funny. <laughs> you slutty, big slut. That's why I got black pussy You're next to me at all times. You're a whore, Steve. You're a whore. 
but a classy one. <laughs> that word is funny to me, whore. <laughs> it just sounds like you medieval whore. times. I oh my god. <laughs> it definitely. Yes. Do I smell a whore? Do I smell a whore? Smell a whore? Go and f- a whore. Go to the whore house. <laughs> Game of Thrones, baby. You know what I would love to do? Take some of these new age chicks, drop them off back in like oh whatever, shut up, just to Don't see what they would no. do. No, they would die. They would get raped. Yeah, <laughs> like that's what it would. She's happen. like, you can't tell me what to I do think, with my body. I think sexy red would have been <laughs> burned at the stake. Like it was, fucking uh, as a heretic. First of all, as soon as we t- as soon as we could add one plus one, we getting burned at the stake back then. Yo, so don't you, do that. Before we wrap up, did you guys watch the? Uh, did you guys see the Terrence Howard Joe Rogan episode? Oh my God, Colt made no. me sit through that, and I'm like, no. He got he debunked. Like everything he was, was like deep. debunked, right? That everything he said, yeah. Because yeah. no, he did the he did he so did Terrence the solo did the episode, solo episode, and then he came and back. And then Eric Weinstein, he's a mathematician, Tishin came back to like kind of debunk what he's saying and everything he was wrong. He, he was them. saying some deep stuff, some shit I didn't. Know. I didn't. I, I think was, he I did he say one times one equals two. Yes. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. And he's like, "This is why." And then this why, man. I want to tell you, you too, man. That's honestly, I I actually like that episode because mine. he really like the guy really was trying very hard to hear him out. He did. He was like really. He's like, listen, because truthfully, I would have loved to have been assigned. I didn't. I didn't realize like the cattiness of science. in the scientist scientific World. community. That's so true. It's very catty and bitchy. Because, no, you want to be smarter than everybody else in the room. And I'm like, they're no different than, like... Shannon Sharp. Politics, like, 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 sports talk, sports radio, talk, and shit Shane like Shane. that. P- people just being people, Steve. People just being people. And I'm just like... But so, but the way he did it, I was like, all right, he he wasn't trying to embarrass him. But then eventually, he was just like, he got fed up. He was just he's like, like listen, he's like, I have no idea what you're talking. He's like, about. I don't know what you're saying now. Yeah. You're you're talking about old shit that's already been proven wrong. Listen, <laughs> okay. I I Mom. love the fact that you're into this. I'm into it, man. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but and then he looks good for me. Yeah. I, but yeah, my man, he's we got to keep He'll Terrence Howard in our prayers. From yo, flow to me, yo. <laughs> Really? All we we gotta get him back in the Iron Man movies. <laughs> you like? I actually like Don Cheadle as. Well, yeah, War no, Machine. me too, me too. I, I'm sorry, I can't picture. Yeah, I couldn't I picture Terrence Howard as War out Machine. Coming the fucking, coming like, who want to fight, man? Oh, you know? no. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, I can't imagine it. I told you, I told spit you. that shit, man. <laughs> spit that shit, man. <laughs> I put my heart in. Yo, tell me you didn't put it in here, man. Oh my! I put my heart goodness. in this, man. A key Come on, team. Slim. Wait, what's his name? Slim. Slim. God, what, I what the fuck was Ludacris' name? Oh, God. Uh, he was so shitty in that movie. He really was. He was a fucking scumbag. He was an asshole. He was great. <laughs> uh, Slim Sutton. Yeah. And it was just like, That's one of my come favorite on, movies. man. Come on, tell me. And then you just beat the shit out of him. And then you get his fucking his little ho. I'm in charge. I'm in charge. Oh, God. She's a mess now. Is she oh, really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. She's a train wreck. Oh, really? Oh, that's, oh, that's kind of sad. Yeah, sad. I thought she was like just a good actress. She did. Me too. She trash. did a movie called Karen. Did y'all see that? Oh my god! When I saw that, I'm like, she's playing that. Wait, that was she funny. What? A movie called Karen about a white it. entitled woman named Karen. Just Karen being Karen. We can't do this shit. It was pretty Come fun. On, it was it. bad and it was. Did hilarious. you watch the BT Awards? Did you guys watch it? I did not. Oh, I didn't. No. I, I heard. I, I heard, heard not so good things. The speeches. I don't even want to watch it because I just feel like it's gonna be cringe. <laughs> yeah. I gotta be honest. If you don't got Joe Budden on your side, where he goes, all right, you're going too far. You got him <laughs> too far. <laughs> That's what he said. He's like, yo, this is just pandering at the highest fucking level. No. And I'm not a Joe Budden fan. I think most of his fucking that takes Usher, are absolutely that retarded. The tribute. tribute was so bad. Actually, like, I didn't watch it. I, I didn't like, watch I can't. it. I actually, they used to do the it best tributes. It was, I actually liked Childish Gambino's rendition of Yeah. He slowed it down. It, it sounded really good. Yeah. And then here come, I love you, girl. Here come Kiki Palmer. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I was like, Ugh. Yeah. Ugh. Jess Hilarious did say like she kind of Disney's everything up. I'm like, oh, oh I didn't even. That's so true, actually. I, like that she, I love Kiki. Me too. 
Anyway, y'all. Yeah. In wrapping up. First off, we're gonna say <laughs> thank you Ish. for Ish. Bye. for swinging I didn't say by. Much, but it was great to be it's here. Y'all are through. funny. Thank you. I just like looking back and forth. <laughs> <laughs> the banter back and forth is hilarious. Oh man. But um, Thanks. thank you again for, uh, for being a part of the episode. Thank you for coming through. Thanks for having me. And uh, yeah. So in wrapping up, I'm your host, Steven. I'm Sam Crystal. Aisha. And as always, <laughs> please stereotype, stereotype responsibly. responsibly. And we'll be back next week with another motherfucking episode. Woo. Peace, y'all. Peace. Bye. Thank you for tuning in to this week's episode of the Minority Plus One Podcast. Podcast. If you rock with us, make sure you hit that like, hit that subscribe, and as always, make sure you stereotype responsibly.